Hi and welcome to Food Photography and Style. In this program we will be talking about my most important food styling tools. One of the most important things when shooting food is that the food looks fresh. But fresh herbs for example are very sensitive and could look dead within seconds of picking. Warm food could look cold after a minute. So it's very important to work quickly. Then your styling tools need to be close to you, pre-prepared when the chef puts the food on the table. I would say that my most important food styling tools are my hands. One rule that I work with when applying for example herbs, salt and oil is don't think too much, let the hands improvise for you. I promise you that the result will be perfect or perfectly imperfect as I like to call it. But sometimes your hands are too big to work with and then tweezers and cut of buds will be invaluable. When you are working with glass and cutlery, a polishing cloth and gloves would be priceless as well. I always bring a styling kit with me for photo shoots that's consisting of a polishing cloth, tweezers, cotton buds, brushes, salt and pepper, a spray bottle with water, a small gas blowtorch, a dishcloth, kitchen roll and gloves. In an earlier program we were talking about the importance of creating highlights. As soon as the food gets a bit cold you need a burner or some oil to make the food look warmer and to create those shiny highlighted parts in the food. Vegetables and herbs almost always need a little water to look fresh. The best way to get a fresh looking result is to use a spray bottle with water. Salt also creates that little extra highlight effect. Pepper also creates an effect, but an effect of that little extra or a perfectly imperfect plated dish. Conclusion Bring a food styling toolkit and keep your styling tools close to you. Herbs, for example, could look dead after a few seconds. Try to create a food photo that gives that little extra. I'm looking forward to seeing your photos on Instagram. Hashtag food photo assignment. Best of luck! Bye!